An international lobby group championing the business development and sustainable innovation team Sayari. Yesterday launched a continental wildlife and environmental conservation program that will see an estimated 10,000 kids from African continent participate in weekly shows that will be premiered next Saturday, September 24, 2022. Uh, ultimately, what we're hoping to achieve with Team Sayari is that kids who watch the program will want to know more, will want to protect their environment, will want to become active participant to caring for the planet uh, and we're doing that through storytelling dubbed a show for the kids by the kids with the kids okay so team sayari is basically um, a show for kids by kids and the main reason i say that is because we wanted to create a show that um, empowers and encourages kids to be change makers um, especially African kids to be change makers and to take ownership of conservation in this beautiful continent of Africa. And that's what Team Syria is about. The talents will seek to use their acting and sporting prowess to boost environmental and wildlife conservation. Meeting new people is actually very fun because you see different personalities, um, different countries they're from and all the different things that they do in their countries like languages. Well, my passion for the environment is the animals. I think the animals are very special, especially lions and sharks. My whole pers perspective about sharks changed while making my episodes about them. Because sharks, like I thought sharks were dangerous animals, like very dangerous, until I did my, um, my episodes and my, my experts told me all about the animals and my whole perception changed. So I think Team Sayari helped me and grow. Um, so Team Sayari has helped me learn a lot of things, such as um, how to conserve the earth. Will you use them for basketball? The show will also seek to impart knowledge among the younger generation on the importance of environmental conservation and sustainable development. My experience with Team Sayari has been really fun so far. I've learned so many new things and met so many new people to become friends with. I'm going to go, I'm going to do many more things about conservation. So some of the conservation activities I've already done in Nairobi National Park were the park cleanup where you pick up trash from the floor that people throw into the national park and also Parthenium pullout. So Parthenium is an invasive plant that's in the national park and when animals eat it they get sick. So I went there with my hands and pulled out the plants individually. The season premiere will be presented as adventurous, meant to enhance environmental conservation and wildlife correlation, to be aired on National Geography and Disney, with the team set to be divided into two major groups, namely the presenters and field reporters. Through taking uh, our wonderful uh, field reporters and our uh, cast in the studio to meet experts, uh, scientists, uh, people who are actively working with animals, taking care of um, the environment and, and uh, flora around them and uh, sometimes the relationship between humans and the environment and animals, wildlife. The future generation is proved to be full of ideas, especially in ensuring that the nature is conserved and will ensure the younger generation understands what is happening. Hence the shows are meant to embrace the kids in three, two, one, go! It is a kids program meant for the kids, 13 years and below, who are enthusiasts in environmental and wildlife, are going to ensure that each and every single piece they showcase is presented to you. Stanley Lugaria for the informer, uncovering the truth.